Monaco GP. Daniel Ricciardo vows to bounce back after crashing McLaren in practice 2. Daniel Ricciardo crashed out in practice 2 after losing control at the swimming pool chicane in another big blow for McLaren. Watch the Monaco GP, F1's most famous event, live on Sky Sports F1, with Saturday qualifying at 3 p.m. and Sunday's race at 2 p.m. Daniel Ricciardo has promised to bounce back after his Monaco GP crash in practice 2, which Sky Sports F1's Nico Rosberg described as another big setback for the McLaren driver. Ricciardo, after starting to lose control through the Lewis Chiron chicane, went flying into the barriers just before the swimming pool chicane, causing a red flag and putting another dent into his hopes of improving on a dismal display at last year's Monaco GP. Sponsored Link. Seniors with hearing loss in Bangkok regret not knowing this. The hearing experts. Recommended by. The incident comes just days after McLaren chief executive Zach Brown told Sky Sports F1's Any Driven Monday the Australian is not meeting the team's expectations. With teammate Lando Norris having consistently outperformed him since the beginning of last season. Leclerc Seals practice double at Monaco GP. Hamilton bemoans bumpiest roller coaster, Leclerc, higher risk to come. Monaco GP. When to watch live on Sky Sports. Ricciardo seemed determined to not let the crash affect the rest of his weekend, suggesting his team may have pushed things too much with their setup of the it obviously happens quickly, but it slowed down as well, Ricciardo said. I knew everything that was happening and I tried to save it, but already into turn 13 I started losing it, I felt the car start to get away from me. I think we just pushed a few things with setup, and pushed a little too far in certain areas. I know they'll fix it. We missed all the session, but I am okay and it'll be ready to go tomorrow. We can bounce back. Rosberg said it was a moment that could define how Ricciardo's weekend unfolds, with the loss of track time on Monaco's tricky circuit a key factor. This is exactly what he didn't need, says Rosberg. This is a track that he knows so well, it could have been a great weekend for him and again it is another big setback. It is so difficult, he broke the rhythm with that and now he only has a couple of laps tomorrow in P3 and at the same, Norris is flying again out there. He is the best of the rest at the moment so it is a tough one. Norris. I am still not 100%. Norris impressed once more, despite continuing his recovery from tonsillitis, he finished fifth in both practice sessions on Friday. The 22-year-old battled through the illness to finish eighth at the Spanish GP last weekend, and says he is still not yet back to full fitness after the first day of racing in Monaco. Almost there. I am not 100% still but, I can't describe how much better I am than this time last week, said Norris. It is 90% gone, I do say, just still struggling a bit with my throat, and coughs. But the main part of my fever is gone. I am in a much better condition, I can enjoy it a bit more and focus when I am driving, and it's been a decent first day. I am reasonably happy. You always enjoy Monaco. It's such a punishing track and the one you have to really test yourself to find the limit. Asked if he wanted to stay in that fifth best of the rest position for qualifying, Norris replied, that's the aim. Sky Sports F1's full TV schedule. All the Monaco GP is live and exclusive on Sky Sports F1, while viewers will also be treated to the world-famous Indianapolis 500 on Sunday night. Saturday, May 28th. 11.45 a.m. Monaco GP Practice 3, Session Starts 12 p.m. 2 p.m. Monaco GP Qualifying Build-Up. 3 p.m. Monaco GP Qualifying. 4.35 p.m. F2 Sprint Race. 5.35 p.m. Ted's Qualifying Notebook. Sunday May 29th. 8.45 a.m. F2 Feature Race. 12.30 p.m. Grand Prix Sunday, Monaco GP Build-Up. 2 p.m. The Monaco Grand Prix. 4 p.m. Checkered Flag. Monaco. 5 p.m. Ted's Notebook. 6 p.m. Monaco GP Highlights. 7 p.m. The Indianapolis 500. Simulcast on Sky Sports Main Event. 